Anthony Hudson. Thanks for joining us for Sunday Afternoon Football. Gary Lyon is with me today. Welcome, Gaz. Hi, Hanno. Always a pleasure to call a game with you. A practice match on the bill today as these two sides test each other out. West Coast set to take on Geelong in this exhibition match today. Geelong run on to the roar of their fans. I'm really looking forward to seeing how they play today. That's true, I don't. We are Geelong, we're always on the ball. We play the game. Today's game will be decided by the Geelong defence. They can create intercept plays and stop the scoring. They'll win this game. The cheer squad's hard work is paying off. The banners are looking great. The captains make their way to the middle for the toss. Geelong winning the toss. Can't wait for this one to begin, and I think the crowd would agree too. They are on the edge of their seats. The opening bounce. One down. Duncan grabbed it clean. Thank you. The umpire will ball it up. What do you make of the game so far, Gary? I'm liking what I'm seeing at the moment, Hutto. A great game of footy. Coughed up by Cripps. Picking it up was Taylor. Marking in space was Duncan. He gets his hands on the footy. The ball spills to Tui. Terrific mark there. Penetrating handball. Can he put it through? Goes wide for a behind. Barrett's unsure of the next move. Takes an uncontested mark. Chose to kick it. Takes it well. Ablett makes it. Elects to kick. Yo flipping the track down the footy. Fends off the tackler. He gains possession. Natanui gets on the end of that handball. What an exciting run. Clears the ball from the contest. Darling clean from the half volley. Looks with hands. He's got the footy in his hands. Tight contest here. Scores locked up. It's a foot race to get this one. Fuse kicks hurriedly. Finds a target. Uses it now. A race for the loose ball. Collects the loose ball. Missed the target. Stewart getting a chance for a break. It'll be a ball up on the outer wing. Natanui thumped it clear. Didn't get low enough with the tackle. A piercing kick from Duncan. And the boundary line wins. Thrown in now. Clears the contest. Hearn comes away with the ball. Hearn will be the recipient of the free. Decides to kick. Nice mark under pressure. Goes with the kick. Strong with the body and wins the mark. Blitzars channels a long kick. Easily takes the mark. Slams it on the boot. A mark by Henry. Advances down. Uses it by foot. Views found some space and mark. Moves it by foot. A chance to reload the attack now. Kelly to have the shot from outside 50. Go for goal number one. On its way. A long way from home. And it goes a long way. What a goal. His 
teammates rush over. The first goal going to West Coast. He did really well there and gets the reward. That goal will be a real confidence boost. You can see he's up and about now. We're back in the middle to resume play. Won the hit out. Difficult ball controlled. Now we'll get a ball up. What are your thoughts at the moment, Gaz? This is a great game, Hutto, and we can just sit back and enjoy it. The loose ball scooped up. He wins the ball in the air. 45 metres out. Go for goal number one. The kick towards goal. The game is back underway. Wins the ruck duel. A bit too hard with the push, and it's a free kick. Puts it on the boot. Gathers it now. Dishes it off. He gets his hands on the footy. O'Connor quickly onto the boot. Off hands from Bablin. Picked off the deck. Handballs to no one in particular. Hits the target by hand. Half it coming on. And now we'll have a ball up. Slapped away. With the ball is Chewy. Dalhouse just hunted him down. Hunts it down. Outstanding pressure. Finds a target. Looks to move it by foot. A strong pack mark. Henry goes with the kick. Marks that ball uncontested. Ball collected. Kelly gets right in his face. Constant pressure and rewarded. Can't take the mark. Cleanly picked up. Waterman going for number two. Literally misses there. The Eagles with the edge right now over Geelong. West Coast are costing themselves with turnover today. They need to find a way to control the play better and stop turning it over. Petricelli gets the loose ball. Shoe used the body to take that mark. He takes aim. Looks okay off the boot. He's excited about that one. No doubt about it. He put through his first goal. Look at him. He really enjoyed that one. Umpire ready to resume play. One down. Dug out the loose ball. Schofield dug out the loose ball. Ends up turning this ball over. West Coast are playing a very controlling game. They're taking plenty of marks and denying the opposition possession. Goes by foot. Couldn't quite get the mark. Rowan going for number one. Three goals now. Won it down. Great control there. Just manufactures what he could. Yo, won himself a free. Decides to go with the barrel. Takes a strong mark. 40 metres out. Go for goal number one. The kick towards goal. Darling blocks that goal. West Coast, 26, like Geelong, 7. They're looking more dangerous inside 50 now. Great reward for effort. Back in the middle, has the rucks go at it. Tap down. He gains possession. And now we'll have a ball up. Can you tell us anything at the moment, Gaz? I'm really enjoying this one, Hutto. As we go into the break, the scores are West Coast 26, Geelong 7. West Coast have come to play. They've got themselves in the game and need to push on now.
Here's Gaz to break down the stats. Geelong can't getting their hands to the ball in the contest. The modern game is ready to go for the second turn. We're back in the middle now. Stanley got a fist to it. Gets a quick kick away. She takes a strong mark. She kicks it to the square. Well collected. Scoops up the ball. Henry collects it. We'll have another ball up. Darling thumps it clear. We'll get a stoppage. Thumps it clear. Use the hands and gives away the free. Puts boot to ball. Open opportunity for Hughes. Sinks the slipper into it. Great mark under pressure. Almost cut it off. Uses his pace. Spears the ball. A race for the loose ball. Just threw the ball. Kick by Parfit. Cripps can create on the turnover. Wants to take them on. Puts it right through the middle. That pushes the lead further out. Pretty happy with that one. West Coast have kicked back-to-back -back goals. The lead is now 25. Punches it clear. He flicks it over. He wins possession. Menegolik links up with a chance to run. Driss wide to go through for a behind. Geelong close the gap to 24. A great mark taken there. Moved on by Carford. Does well to cut off the kick. The kick from Gav. Picks up the loose ball. What can you tell us, Gaz? I'd really love it if these teams took the contest to the next level. With quick hands. Doing well was Taylor. Radigalia uses it by foot. Lining up for goal. Hawkins going for number one. Now they look to trap this ball inside their own 50 and cause a turnover. Geelong reduce the margin. Barris to bring it back into play. Nelson finds the ball on the move. Works the ball up the ground. Doing well with the mark. With a driving kick. Good mark and looks to send it back. West Coast just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside 50. Good mark by Petrocelli. Decides to go. Holding the ball. Fails to fend off the tackler. Showing some really good pressure there. Looks up with the kick. Takes the mark. West Coast just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside 50. Looks like the ball will be coming back. Pumps the ball long. Intercepts the ball well. Taylor puts it on the boot. Takes that one strongly. Rowan rushes with the kick. Marked by Menegola. Moves the ball by foot. McGovern gathers it now. Puts it on the boot. Gets into a good position to take it. West Coast have the lead, but they're allowed plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of their game if they're to stay on top. For the Eagles. Now they lead by 29. Stanley with the punch. Selwood just gets it out of the boot. Couldn't complete the mark. Finds the loose ball. Guthrie goes it alone. Made the goal up by a move. And it, Geelong still hopeful of reducing this margin. The loose ball picked up. Up, we'll get a ball up. What can you tell us at this stage, Gary? I'm waiting for something to change the way this game is going right now. 
Yo was taken high in the tackle. Goes with the kick. Marks now and can send it back. West Coast haven't been able to set up any set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect your forward to kick a winning title that way. He gives away a free for in the back. Colin Jasny gets in a good position. Puts boot to ball. Handball finds Shuey. Takes possession. He has the ball. The tackle slipped high and results in a free. Carpet moves it now. Stanley spills it, collects the loose ball. Quick handball. Stephen clears the ball from the contest. A chance to put one through for his side. This will certainly test him from this distance. Guthrie going for number one. Guthrie has missed the lot out of the full. Jetta pumps the ball long. Shuey couldn't snaffle it. Gathered by Duncan. Gets the handball away. Carpet was taken high in the tackle. He decides to go for home. Into the post it goes. They really... Jill, players move as they look to provide an option. Jetta with an easy mark. There's the danger for now. Not much time left in the corner. Dalhouse with the ball. Myers will be the recipient of the free. Hook the kick wide and a behind. Once again, they failed to convert these chances. Geelong, trying to, the Eagles are in the lead by 26 at the half. West Coast have had a solid first half and will look to show more of the same in the second. What can you tell us from the stats, Gaz? Geelong have had a stack of uncontested marks, but it's not working for them at the moment. They... We're set to go at the start of the third quarter. Thrashes it. Parfit takes it well. Finding the loose ball was Alhouse. Goes inside forward 50. Hawkins grabs that one. 40 metres from home. Going for goal number one. That kick has missed everything. Hawkins with a poor kick out of play. Drives the kick hard. Does well to cut off the kick. Rowan has a chance to put a second goal on the ball. Reduce the margin. Back in the middle now. Nananui won the hit out. Has it now. Interesting handball. Taylor wins it back. Sweeping handball. He just can't get out of the action. Up for grabs for Gav. Blitzarves looking for options now. It's a foot race to get this one. Well taken at ground level. Parker applying, applying the physical pressure. Hit the man hard. Charges with intent. What can you tell us, Gas? I'd really love it if these teams took the contest to the next level. Swanson. Ready to bring it back into play. Doesn't hold on to the mark. Selwood collects the loose ball. Reddit penalised there. Selwood going for distance with the kick. Spills the mark. Gives it. Don't argue. Looks up with the kick. Radigaliak had it. Lost it. The umpire calls for it. Hammers it. Is in his possession. Pushes off the tackler. Slips the handle to Hawkins. Missed for a behind. Barracks considering the options on the kicky. Coughed up by Collar Jasney. Uses a short hand. The ball in the hands of Dalhouse. They can create from this. Hacks it on the boot. Buse looks to work it from the turnover. Mops up the loose ball.
releases under pressure. He's got the football now. Shuey just streaming past and gets the footy. Doesn't connect with the kick, and it'll be coming back. Bangs it on the boot now. O'Connor gets in a good position. Goes by foot. Taylor marks. Chips it towards half forward. Buse kicks it out, and the ball will be coming back. Schofield drives the kick. Good mark and looks to send it back. Well, when you look at the shots of goal, there just hasn't been enough scoring opportunities being created. Get the ball inside 50 and give your forwards a chance to take a mark. West Coast forwards are dangerous anywhere inside 50. They just need to be given a shot. Rowan already has two goals. This for a third. Trail by 15. It's great to watch that. Eh? Plenty of excitement. Umpire ready to resume play. Clears the contest. Quickly onto the boot. Marking in space was Alhouse. Keeps it alive under some pressure. The kick comes close. That is offline. The score, looking for options now. Whoa, look at the view from up there. The Eagles can't allow too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. Releases by hand. Just put it on the boot. Finds this and marks well. Goes the barrel. Kennedy takes the mark uncontested, 35 metres out. Shapes to open up the angle. Shaping the kick for the banana. Going for goal number one. Brilliant stuff, and he puts it through. Kennedy puts them further in front. Smiles all round. 20 points the difference. We're back in motion. Barty with the hit. He's the number one ranked player on the ground. The opposition need to get a hold of him. Made the tricky bounce look easy. Fighting hard was Waterman. Waterman throws the ball away. Taylor elects to kick. Connor Jasny with the mark. Elects to kick. Needs a bit of a rest. Fantastic pressure there. A good mark circumstances need to be kick if he's going to put this through got boot to ball the contest no match for him good call Hutto. goes for the goals a great goal Duncan can put through his first he's enjoying that goal Geelong still within touching distance back with another set of bounce Winning it was Barty. Did well not to confuse himself. Shuey just handballs into space. Gets the loose ball. Quickly onto the boot. She must have double vision. Just gets it onto the boot. Buse takes it strongly. Kicks out of the congestion. Nice mark under pressure. The Eagles haven't been able to set up many set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forwards' fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect your forward to kick a winning total that way. Abler going for number one. A disappointing kick. Deciding where to go with the kick in. What did you think of the third term, Gaz? West Coast believe they can win this game. It's time to show it. Let's check out the stats. Geelong have been better around the contest, but they need to make the most of that stat and put it on the scoreboard.
Thank you very much, Gaz. One quarter of footy to go. Can't afford any mistakes from here. They have to be perfect. The handball now from O'Connor. Dalhouse links with a teammate who can run. Dalhouse earns a free kick. He goes for broke. Doesn't get near the goals there. Dalhouse kicks it out of bounds on the full. Moves the ball out of defence. The ball locked up. Stephen heads towards the goals. The top part sails between the big sticks. His teammates rush over. The Cats could kick back-to-back -back goals. Just under two goals, the difference now. A great bit of play that resulted in that. It hasn't always been clean, but they've got the goal. About to resume hostilities. Punched away. The bounce made it tough for Natanui. Slick with the hands. Sends it clear of the contest. A chance to gather the ball. The ball spills free. Intercepted. The mark is taken by Stephen. Slams it on the boot. Great mark under pressure. Sinks the slipper into it. Ends up marking and contesting. Tui decides to play on. Dangerfield with an easy mark. Looks like the ball will be coming back. He drives it. He takes the mark. She lines up from long range. West Coast by eight points. Blitzarves searching for a teammate. Gets it away. With the ball now. Wins the race to the ball. There'll be a ball up close to goal. The players will be feeling the heat right now. He gains possession. Duggan releases it under pressure. Selwood links up with a chance to run. Drives it out of the pack. Gav gets on the end of this. Needs a big kick if he's going to put this through. Over the top of the pack, 20 metres from home. Kennedy looking to put through another goal. Gets some rewards for his efforts. West Coast, but 14. Back in the middle to resume play now. Nananui clears the contest. Gaff wins the ball in the air. West Coast for allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. The boundary line wins. Ball over the line. The ball is coming back into play. Nananui thumps it forward. He's got the footy in his hands. Avoids the tackler. Stewart got the hands free. Guthrie scoops it up. Picks it up. Ball picked up. Wants to keep it moving. Buse goes to the man on the run. Moves the ball by foot. Takes a nice mark. 50 metres out. Keep it on. Going for goal number one. Ablick shanks the kick. And it will be coming back. He puts it out of bounds on the full. McGovern kicks it. He wins the ball in the air. West Coast have the lead, but they're allowing plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of their game if they're to stay on top. Off hands. Nice work from Schofield. Chose to kick it. Tui didn't mark it. Practicing some fancy moves. Taylor puts it out in front. Kelly gets on the end of that handball. The drop pass goes straight between. The umpire set to bounce to restart the game. He wins possession, wasting a lot of effort there. And now Fuse, he's been in everything, keeps it moving. He has the ball. That tackle just too high. But right on the edge of his range. Taking a nice grab. 
Blutzarves to get the free kick. Wants to move it quickly. Looks to move it by foot. It's marked by Rowan. West Coast just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside 50. Radagalia going for number one. A time to celebrate. He celebrates hard after that. Geelong close the gap to 14. Centre bounce. Vardy gets onto the ball. Umpire calls for the ball. Can you tell us? I'm loving what this game is giving us right now. The loose ball picked up. Vardy going for number one. Good mark there. Kennedy should have no trouble from here. Looking to bring this around the body. Goes through from behind. The margin. Teammates break for him. Decides to play on there. Uses it now. The mark has been taken. Decides to kick. Kelly found a way to mark that one. Off hands from Blitzarves. West Coast are costing themselves with turnover today. They need to find a way to control the play better and stop turning it over. Uses it by foot. Steven found some space and marked. Plays on now. A solid mark from Buse with a driving kick. Intercepts the ball very well. West Coast have the lead, but they're allowing plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of their game if they're to stay on top. A chance to reload the attack now. Colin Jasny with a chance to line up the goal. Moves it by foot. Great mark in the pad. Hughes sets his sights on the goals. 35 metres out. for joining us. We'll see you again soon. It's been a pleasure, Hutto, and we'll catch you next time.